And also joining us is Jeanette Jenkins from the Hollywood Trainer to show them some exercises that are hopefully going to improve sexual fitness because a lot of people have these questions. So let's get into some moves that people can use at home to improve sexual fitness. Okay, well, I have a couple of exercises that are going to help Nick and Liz improve their sex life. Y'all ready for some sex exercise? Absolutely. All right. <laughs> well, come down to your hands and knees. Well, one of the problems that Nick mentioned is that he gets lower back pain. So we're going to do a stretch called the cat-cow. You're going to go on your hands and knees and just round your spine. And as you round your spine, you're scooping out and squeezing your abdominals, and you're stretching the muscles that lie in your spine. And this is going to help relieve lower back stress by stretching those muscles. Then you release and lift your head up and do it again. Just do it a couple times, and you're, you're also... Um, manipulating the pelvis as you do this, and the pelvis is doing flexion and extension. And we all know we use the pelvis <laughs> when we're having sex, so this is a good thing. <laughs> then um, the other thing that Liz mentioned is that she gets pains in the bottom of her feet. And so what you want to do is come back onto all fours. Now press back on the ball of your foot. And what you're stretching is your fascia lata. Go ahead, give it a try. Step your right foot back, just one foot at a time, and push your heel towards the floor. And as you're wow. doing that, you're stretching the fascia that's in the bottom of your foot. And yes, switch and try the other side. Okay. Okay, you got it. So there's a good stretch that can stretch out that fascia so you won't have the cramps in the bottom of your feet when you're right at that moment, right? That's right. That's <laughs> right. Okay, no. everything. So like, that Wait, ruins everything. It does ruin everything. What moment? <laughs> at that moment, like, oh. And then you're like, you, but it's you, my you foot. You don't want to be in pain. Right. You don't, don't want to feel your foot pain. at that moment. <laughs> and also you can... Uh, include the Dr. Kegel exercise. Oh, of course. Relaxing yes. and tightening the vaginal muscles. Yes, you, yes, relaxing and tightening the vaginal muscle is very important for both of you to get the benefit from that. And you can do it in the car, not while driving, but at every red light. Oh, I agree. And drink into the car next to you. Definitely, 100%. <laughs> Ruth, I'm doing them right now. You can do it. <laughs> Wonderful. Keep on doing it. <laughs> All right, let's show us. This. We got another well, neat exercise here. The last exercise we had, which, uh, Liz was mentioning that she gets cramps, Charlie horses, Charlie on horse. your hips, mm -hmm. which is a horrible feeling. So we're going to stretch the muscles on the inside and outside of the hips. So bring your feet together. Okay. And this is a butterfly stretch. You just press the knees open. You're stretching the inner thigh. Ooh. Okay. And then you cross the legs and reach forward. And you're stretching the external rotators of the hips. And these muscles, when they get tight, they pinch on the sciatic nerve, which creates an evil pain down your leg and sometimes a charley horse. So again, we don't want to feel, oh my God, my hip, right? Nick, pretty, we want to feel something else. I'm, pr I'm pretty <laughs> impressed with Nick though. Nick, you yeah. got some reach there. <laughs> pretty flexible. So, uh, so that's going to help your whoopee life. All right. Well, so, <laughs> Liz, Nick, thank you. Good luck to you and Jeanette. These are exercises yes. people can use at home. Yeah, exactly. Everybody can do these anytime at all. Thank you so much.